Now, experts say it's always best to buy tickets from a verified seller. I spoke with one mother this evening who said that their plans to go to the game are now in limbo after they paid $1,600 for tickets only to find out that it was a scam. Long Island mom of six, Carrie Weiss, was searching high and low for Bill's playoff tickets for the whole family. So in one of the Bill's groups, um, we, we put in there, hey, anybody have eight tickets, which it's really hard to come by. Almost giving up on snagging tickets to the highly anticipated game. And all of a sudden, this guy was like, hey, me and my brother have eight tickets. I was like, Perfect. On Tuesday, after a few chats via Facebook, Wise sent $1,600 for the eight tickets via payment app Zelle. And I said, can you include the parking pass because they wanted like $200 a ticket. I was like, sure. Wary of sending money to people she doesn't know, she hoped his account was the real deal. But she says once she sent it, he told her he never got it and instead began asking for more money. And I was like, listen, bud, I am not giving you any more money. She called the man via Facebook, but was met with a dead end after he hung up on her. So instead of eight tickets to a playoff game, Weiss was left empty handed and out $1,600. Buffalo is everybody loves each other. There is no scamming there. there. I mean, people invite you into your homes and every, I mean, it's just, it's wonderful up there. She says it's a lesson learned. And experts we spoke to say you need to be extremely wary of using payment apps to buy things like tickets to major events. Oh, you don't want to use a cash app or a debit card. And the reason for that is that if there is an added surcharge to the, the price, or if you're paying more than you're not supposed to, or if it is uh, you've fallen victim to a scam, your credit card company is going to be able to help you uh, mitigate that process and get your money back. Those same protections aren't available if you use a debit card or a cash app. Better Business Bureau Upstate New York Communications Director Matt Kruger says to protect yourself. Avoid pop-up ads on sites saying that they're offering tickets at a discounted price and know exactly who you're ordering from. And sticking with trusted and verified vendors and businesses will be your best bet to keep bad actors away from your money.